When Chapman Billy's leave the street and toothy neighbours, neighbours mate, as market days are wearing late and folk begin to tack the gate while we's at boozing at the nappy, getting through and uncle happy. We think the little Langscot smiles, the mosses, water slaps and styles that lie between us and our home, where sits our sulky, sullen dame, gathering her brows like gathering storm, nursing her wrath to keep it warm. This truth found honest Tam O'Shanter, as he for a year and night to canter, will later on in a tune surpasses for honest men and bonny lasses. Oh Tam, without but being so wise, as Tina in with Kate's advice, she told the wheel there was a skill, my blethering, blustering, drunken blown that found November to October, a market night, there was no sober, the Ilka Melder with the Miller that sat as long as Lewis so that every nag was cut as she on the Smith and Dee got roaring through on. Then the Lord says, even on Sunday, they drank with Kirk and Jean till Monday, she prophesied that later soon they would be found eating round and doon, or catch a warlock in the murk by Alloway's or haunted Kirk, a gentle dame that guards me greet, to think of any counsel sweet, and money length and sage advices to husbandry the wife despises. But to her tale, a market night, Tamron got planted Uncle Wright, fast by an ankle blaze, and finally were reaming swats that drank divinely, and at his elbow suit her Johnny, his ancient trusty Druthy crony, Tam loved them like a very brother they had been through for weeks together. The night drew on, the sangs and clatter, and I, the ale was growing better. The landlady and Tam grew gracious with favour, secret, sweet and precious. The suitor told his queer story, the landlord's laugh already chorus. The storm without my grey and rustle tanned in the mind, the storm a whistle. Care, mad to see a man so happy, even drowned a cell among the nappy. As bees flee him, we laid the treasure, the minutes winged their way with pleasure. Kings may be blessed, but Tam was glorious, or are the elves of life victorious? But pleasures are like poppy spread, he sees the flower as bloom is shred. Or like the snow falls in the river, a moment white and melts forever. Or like the Borealis race that flit there, you can point her place. Or like the rainbow's lovely form, may vanishing amidst the storm. Nay man can tether time or hide. The hour approaches to him on right. The hour of night's black arch to key stain the dreary hour. He mounts his beast in such a road. Such a night he tacks the road and his near sinner was abroad in. The wind blew his twig blown its last. The rattling shower rose on the blast. The speedy gleams the darkness swallowed loud, deep in line. The thunder bell. That night a child might understand the devil had business on his hand. We were mounted on his grey mare Meg, a better never lifted leg. Tom scalped on through dub and mire, despising wind and rain and fire, despite despising wind and rain and fire, with holding fast his good blue boy, with crooning hours from old Scots sonnet. Well, glowering round the prudent cares, his bogles catch him unawares. Kirk Alloway was grown nigh, where gay soon hoolets nightly fly. By this time he was across the ford, where in the snow the chapman smoored, and past the burks and meekle stain where drunken Charlie Brack's neck bane. And through the winds and by the cairn where hunters found the murdered bear, and near the thorn aboon the well where Mungo's mother hanged herself. Before him, doom pours all his floods, the doubling storm roars through the woods, the lightning flash from pole to pole, near and more near the thunders roll, when glimmering through the groaning trees, Kirk Galloway seemed in a blaze. Through El Cabor, the beams were dancing, and loud resounding mirth and dancing. Inspiring bold John Barleycorn, but dangers thou could make a scorn. With Tippany, we fear no evil, we wish could be, we'll face the devil. The swats he reamed in Tammy's noddle for, care, for play, he cared no devil's a bottle. But Maggie stood right, Sarah stories to by the heel and hand admonished, she ventured forward on the light, and while Tom saw an uncle's sight. Warlocks and witches in a dance, Nico Tillion, Brent, New Free France, but horned by jigs, trust bays and reels, but life and metal in their heels. A winning bunker in the east, their saddled neck and shape of beast, a towsy type, black, grim and large, to give them music was his charge. He screwed the pipes and got them skirled to roof and rafters, added dull. Coffins stood round the open presses and showed the deed in their last traces, and by some devilish country of slight, each in its cult and held a light, by which heroic Tam was able to note upon the holy table. A murderer's banes and gibbet airns, twa span lang we unchristened beards. A thief knew cut free a rape by his last gasp was gabbed and gape. Five tomahawks with blood red rusted, five scimitars were murder crusted. A garter which a babe had strangled, a knife a feather's throat had mangled. And his ain son of life bereft, the grey hairs it stuck to its heft. A mere horrible and offer, to even name them would be an offer. As Tammy glowered amazed and curious, the mirth and fun grew fast and furious. The pipers loud and louder blew, the dancers quick and quicker flew, the reel they set, the cross they click it to Ilka Carl and Swat and Rika, and kissed the duddies on the work and link it at an inner sark. Through the breaks of mine, my only pair, the ains were plush and good blue hair, I would have gave them off my hardies for a blink of the bonny birdies. But withered beldams, old and droll, red woody hags would spin a foe, looking and flinging on a crummock, I wondered didn't it turn thy stomach. The time came what was what through brawly, there was a winsome wench and wally that night enlisted in the core long after Ken and Carrick shore, for many a beast did then she shot from perish money a bonny boat, and shook both meekle corn and bear, and kept the country side in fear. Her cuddy sark with paisley horn, the while the lassie she had worn, in longitude though sorely scanty, it was her best, and she was vanty. A little kind of reverend granny, the sark she coughed for her wee nanny, with twa pun scots, twas all her riches, whatever grace had danced so witches. But here my wing her but here my muse her wing mon cower, such flights are far beyond her power to sing her nanny lap and flying a simple jade she was in strength. How Tom stood like e'en bewitched and thought it very e'en enriched. Even Satan 
Cloward and Fidge through Fane and Hodgson Blue are might and main till first to Caper sign another Tam Tint is freezing all together and roars out, Wheel done, Cotty Sark, and in an instant all was dark. And scarcely had he Maggie rallied when out the hellish legion sallied. As bees fit busy with angry fight, when plundering herds assailed their bike, as open pussies mortal foes when pops she starts before their knee nose, as eager runs the market crowd, when catch the thief resounds aloud, so Maggie runs, the witches follow him on an eldritch screech and hollow. O oh, Tam, O oh, Tam, they'll get they'll fearing, and hell they will stay like a heron, and vain thy Kate awaits a coming, soon Kate will be a woeful woman. Now do thy speedy utmost, Meg, and when the key stain all the brig, they are at them thou thy tail may toss, a running stream they dare not cross. But ere the key stain she could make, the faint of tail she had to shake, for nanny far before the rest, hard upon noble Maggie pressed, and flew at Tam, a furious ale, but little was she Maggie's mail. He sprang right off her master hail, but left behind her angry tail, the carl and clotter by the rump, and left poor Maggie scarce a stomp. Now why this tale of truth shall read, that man and mother's son take heed, when her to drink yarn and clyde, or cut his sarps run in your mind, think ye may buy the drought joys, our dear, remember Tam O'Shanter's mare. The end. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, fuck. That's under six minutes. Yeah.